Newton from the city to the coast. The WBZ News team is live at polling places and victory parties as November's ballot is set. And we are going beyond the numbers, analyzing what tonight's results mean for the general election. Now, this was the race to watch tonight. Trump loyalist Jeff Deal versus manufacturing executive Chris Doty. Deal pulls ahead and wins the nomination after the trend of Trump endorsements carry weight nationwide. And Deal will face off against the Democrat Maura Healey in November. Healey ran virtually unopposed after Sonia Chang Diaz dropped out back in June. WBZ's Christina Rex kicks off our team coverage tonight. She is at the Deal victory party in Weymouth. Christina. Yeah, David, Jeff Deal just finished his speech just a few minutes ago. He says Chris Doty did call him and concede tonight. He says his focus now shifts to appealing directly to the people of Massachusetts and separating himself from Maura Healy. Now, in his speech tonight to do so, he called Healy a radical, saying she puts big government before individual freedom and higher taxes. He called her the people's worst nightmare in Massachusetts. That's a direct quote. He claims Healy wants woke education in the classroom but he wants parents in charge of their kids' education. He also claims Massachusetts is losing residents at a rapid pace. He also talked about tax breaks, saying he wants to give all budget surplus money back to the people, claiming that will never happen with Healy as governor. And he mentioned a hot topic in the state house lately, saying the state should not give driver's licenses to undocumented immigrants. That was really the gist of his speech. It was a really short speech. Here's just a little bit more of what he just said. For the first time in our state's history, we're going to run a campaign that is focused specifically on we the people, our freedoms, our rights, and our prosperity. And I did speak to Jeff Deal in a little one-on-one uh, -on -one just a few minutes ago following that speech. I asked him about President Trump because, as we know, President Trump endorsed him in this race. And I asked him if he feels that made a big difference. He says, yes, he does feel like that was a big push for him in this primary race tonight. He says he appreciated everything Trump did for him and everything Trump did as president. He says he has not heard from President Trump tonight. And he also said he wants to shift his focus now, maybe away from that and towards appealing directly to the people of Massachusetts. He mentioned including independent voters. That's the latest here in Weymouth. Christina Rex, WBZ News. All right, Christina, thank you. And in choosing